Welcome, everybody. Are you excited? Yes. Okay, I'm going to start to show you guys uh, a new system that I got. It's called the Button. It's an instant weight system that, that you can use for any kind of lures. Soft plastics, spinner baits, crank baits, jerk baits, tail baits, almost anything. You can actually make a shallow jerk bait into a sinking jerk bait in just a couple of seconds. And it doesn't really affect the, the swimming pattern of the lure. So, here's a classic Tixara, 17 centimeters, 93 grams. But I added a 10 gram the button on it. You can also add it in the front of the lure, on the on the lip, or in the the front hanger, or in the back if you want to make a top water bait or whatever. So it comes from two grams up to 10 grams, and it's super versatile. It's a complete game changer. It comes with a, a filt pattern that you can cut out so you don't have to, to damage the paint job on the lures. Or you can leave it up so you get a little bit of rattle effect to it as well. Super effective. It's also very, very good to add it when you have shallow rig soft plastics in the front nose. It will give you a little bit extra drag power in the water. That means that you push more water when you retrieve the lure and it gives more reatic, reatic on, uh, pattern to it. The thing with the McTail, if you have a, a 5 gram up there and a 2 gram back there, you still have the lighting action. So it's super, super. And how do you attach it? Just remove this rip ring, yeah. put it on yeah. and, and... And you can add them on any type of lure, even handmade lures, because the slot to it is as big as the biggest loops on a handmade lure as well. Okay. So it's very versatile. Okay. Any questions about the button? Johnny's tail. But we made a little bit tweak to it. A thinner version, solid ABS, sink weights, and a super glide. Very shallow. Comes with three O hooks. If you change it to two O hooks, it actually stands still in the water. It's a really shallow runner. We're allowed to use these ones now, right? I guess. Huh? Big enough, 102 grams. Yes. Just with the reel, super, super lighter. Okay, take a, a big truck and ride it because it's, it's ABS, one piece. It comes in two versions, one top water one that's floating, if you want to fish for GT or any kind of top water predators. You can put a big tail to it, can add almost anything, like a bigger tail, smaller tail, weather tail, you can actually add a spinner plate to it in fact. Super versatile. I have a couple of those if anyone is interested in the back of my car. I brought a shop this year. <laughs> yeah. This one's got a little bit more sink to it. And you see on the back there, on the tail, there's a, an orange, that's the quick dip. In each bag you had a black one in there. It comes in a, a lot of different colors. And it's, it's a game changer. It will make you go from zero to a hero with an instant dip. <laughs> you believe it? Okay, big McTail, the giant one. Super easy glide. You don't even have to jerk it. I use this one a lot of in tournaments because it covers so much water. Super fast attached tail to it. So the glide bait itself is like this, but we developed a small system called the tail hiker. 
it will be a complete game changer as well. It can turn any kind of bait into tail bait. Or you can add almost, I mean, let, for example, let's say that you have amazing pike fishing and the pike takes the paddle. Take the hitchhiker, add a blade or something, attach it in the, in the back of, instead of the paddle, and you have a new bait. So it's super fast attached. It's a small tail to it, tall tail screw and a small clip. A little bit of sun there and you will have a rave party. <laughs> <laughs> the flashers are perfect. You take the, the best features of a blinker with a soft plastic. And with the vibration and the flash, it actually changed a lot of my fishing. How many of you guys have tried this already? The flash ones? Yeah. Have you noticed any difference with them? Better fishing, worse fishing? Same. Same. Even in sunlight? In dark ropes? <laughs> <laughs> Much softer rubber. Yeah. We changed every, all our rubber is nowadays, it's actually German rubber that we buy in Germany, ship it to China and use it. Because the German rubber is the most eco-friendly rubber in the world, actually. No aftalots at, at all. You can actually drink that plastic salt. It's super, super good. So, uh, and it's more durable as well. So, hooray for Germany! <laughs> yeah, good. Okay, anything else you guys want to see or do you want to go fish now? You want to go fishing? Let's go fishing. No looking. You want to see how to use the quick dip? Everyone's got a black one. Shake it. Shake it like a you know, good, good reggae concert. I want to love you and treat you nice. Okay. Open it up. Don't smell it too much because then you're going to see angels. It's <laughs> from China. No, this is actually from Holland. <laughs> they like the, the skunk, you know. Anyway, this one, it's a acetone and thinner compound. That means if it's open too much, it will concentrate because the acetone vapors in the air. So if it gets too thick, just add some more acetone to it. The best way of using this to get the paint to stick as good as possible is to clean the bait with acetone first. But I mean, you can do it instantly on the water. What you do? Sorry? Foul color? Foul color? UV. Yeah. So, everyone's got a, a small piece of cloth in there. We have to go in there. There you go. <laughs> so good. Okay, soft plastic. Just go over it. And then you have a, a little bit different. It dries in about two to five minutes, depending on how humid the air is. And leave it there just for a second. Then we take uh, some of the magic UV reactive fluorescent <laughs> orange. You like fluorescent orange? You do. <laughs> <laughs> I love it too. <laughs> you want to change? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Take the paddle, uh, the tail. Just leave it in there. A tip is not to use too much when you dip a paddle because this one gets a little bit stiff. 
So it's only made for small details. Okay? Okay. Kleine Detailien. <laughs> You can use it in any any kind of way. So I'm going to start showing you guys how to pimp uh, uh, a McRubber. Okay, this is the plain one. We have a, a clear quick dip. How many of you guys like gold? You like gold, yeah. Gold is good. Say gold after me. Gold. 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 No, more. Gold. 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 Yeah. gold. One more time. Gold. That's how we do it. Okay. Low cuts. <laughs> okay. Take the paddle. Chuck it in the quick dip like this. The whole thing. And you take it and chuck it in here with the gold. Oh. Let it dry for about five, ten minutes. Then you have a gold petal. You can use it with silver, glow in the dark, fluorescent colors, whatever. So this is especially I noticed this for especially for perch. Sometimes on really slow days with perch, you need a little bit of extra advantage. Or in sunlight with pike. Or if you fish halibut. How many of you guys fish halibut? Yeah. That extra glitter tail could be like from zero to hero. Okay? So what do we call this? Go! Good. All right. What's very important when you fish for carp? Like scents and stuff. Stinky shit that smells awful. <laughs> that could also be an extra advantage when you fish for predatory fish when it's slow. So we developed three different scents just for gumikura. We have baitfish, garlic, and clam. And these ones are super strong. So if you just dip them in the gumikura, leave it in a plastic bag, it's going to stink like a motherfucker the whole day, <laughs> the whole day after, and the whole day after that. So, uh, is anyone hangover today? <laughs> no hangover? Ah, come, smell. <laughs> smell this. Push them around. Especially that one. I used to fish a lot of sea trout back in the day. The fly. So we bought carp boily with sardine smell and shrimp smell and squid smell. We put the flies in the scent over the night to the bag. And Pass auf, das ist das Gesicht, Bruce. Just love them. There's a bag in the You know dead bait fishing? That stinks good. Yeah. Stinky sardines and shit. Yeah. Same thing there. It works really, really good. Can thunder fishing? So maybe today we need the stinky shit to get some good pipes. <coughs> Look skeptical. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. Do you believe in sound? Yes. Is sound a good thing for pike? I think yes. And colors? UV reactive colors? We have three different rattle chambers developed three of them are made from lexan you know lexan yeah. super strong shit doesn't break we have them in fluorescent yellow fluorescent red and transparent and my experience is if you attach those in the paddle you get a very high up noise like you know rave disco but for example, a McRubber, when you fish the McRubber, it goes click, 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 mm -hmm. like this. If you attract the rattle straight in there, you will have a low sound. Click, 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 click. Okay? You tried it? No. No, no rattle chambers? Yeah. Works? Super good. The other thing we also did, 
a metal one. This one weighs 1.5 grams. And when you add that in the paddle, you get a more reactive paddle, a bigger movement to it, especially if you have a larger paddle like on the McRubbers. It goes faster, it moves a lot more water. That could also be a super good game show. Okay? Okay? Yeah. Good, 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 good. What do you think about the smell? <coughs> It's strong. It's, it's yeah, good. It is. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Brush your teeth with it. <laughs> okay. The other thing is, so we developed an, another product called Quick Fix. This one works 24 hours, 365 days a year. Depend. Doesn't matter if it's cold, warm, or whatever. The only thing it doesn't work with is when the lures are oily or wet. This thing. Uh, kind of glues the rubber much faster than the other brands. It's super, super good. No, no, it's Gumiko uh, fix. Yeah, okay. It's the same we uh, made it? Yeah, but much better. Okay. <laughs> of course, it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> Must be better. Must be better. <laughs> okay. It stinks. Really good. <laughs> okay. Leave it on there for like five minutes. It's ready to go. Oh, ah, it starts there. You want to wait for five minutes? No. No. You want to catch fish? Yeah. 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 Good. Thank you so much, guys. Thank <laughs> <laughs>